Look who it is, the newest superstar to join Monday Night Raw. I wish you'd get that excited when I walk into a building. Byron's excitement is warranted. She's going to do big things here on Raw. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Women's Intercontinental Championship. This woman is ready to fight. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. A woman who has elevated her game. She knows it will take her very best to walk away as champion.
Saxon, when's the last time you took flowers to the gravesite of those detestable, inflatable friends? I beg your pardon. Hey, despite what you think about Bailey, there's no denying what she's accomplished. The first Grand Slam champion in the women's division. Yeah, there's also no denying that Bailey has no problem stepping on anyone along the way. It's because Bailey thanks herself for all of her accomplishments. And you can't argue with the results. Bailey knows how to win. Corey, you think she can be great on commentary with you? I have my doubts, but let's just have Bailey stick to the ring where she's at her best. I mean, this table already has its role model. Thank you. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, stunning Sandra Brown. And introducing the champion from San Jose, California, the women's intercontinental champion. A title coveted by legends and hungry young talent alike. Do you guys have any expectations for this superstar as this match gets underway? Yeah, I expect to see a side of her that we've only seen glimpses of. We're talking about her mean streak really coming to the forefront. She certainly has that malicious side of her, and it could be extremely beneficial to let it out here. Yeah, and Bayley, she's got a list of accomplishments in both NXT and WWE a mile long. She truly is a role model, and if we're lucky, maybe, just maybe, she'll beat some recognition into her competition here tonight. Uh, if we're lucky, maybe Bailey will focus more on actually proving she's a role model instead of being a hypocrite. A talented hypocrite, but still a hypocrite. My jumpy DDT! My. Spin kick to the midsection. Our wrist clutch suplex. Big right hand. Look at that counter from Bailey. She got launched. Coming back in the ring. Take down. <laughs> Saw that one coming. Bailey's got her hook. And Bailey connected nicely there as she gets herself out of a precarious position. The champ looking out of sorts. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Brain Buster! <laughs> she scores big with the counter. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Oh, 
some damage. Wow, that won't separate your shoulder. That'll divorce it. The challenger eating up some damage. Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. A knee drop! She's on unsteady legs in the corner. Needs to recover. She catches Bailey with a counter. Big right hand. This is not going to end well. Oh, oh, oh. After blow combo, the champ's shoulders are down. champion, stunning, Sandra Brown. I still can't believe it. There you see our new champion. What a stunning moment. These superstars gave everything they had, but the new champ wanted it just a little bit more. The following contest is scheduled for one fall 
and is for the Women's Intercontinental Championship. She's in a fighting mood tonight. The champ comes into his title defense incredibly confident, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. A win here cements her as one of the great champions of this era. She calls herself the EST. WWE Universe, you are looking at a superstar who is just naturally better than everybody else, even when only doing the bare minimum. Bianca's been exceptional her entire life. She earned all SEC and all American honors in track and field at the University of Tennessee. And if you just ask her, she'll tell you why she's better than everybody else. You got eyes, Byron, you understand. Introducing the challenger from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair! And introducing the champion from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia, the Women's Intercontinental Champion, stunning Sandra Intensity on the face of the champion. Challenger in the corner, looking more determined than I've ever seen. And here's a woman on a mission. She has the singular goal of being the most dominant superstar in the women's division. And she has no issue getting in your face about it either. She doesn't care who she has to run over. There is no second place for her in any competition. And Bianca Belair, known as the EST of WWE. If you find yourself wondering exactly what that means, that's probably because you've never been the best at anything in your life. Talking to you, Byron. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Ooh, what a forearm club. And Bianca turning around. Back and forth from these competitors. Cha-ching. Step up, Enziguri. Absolutely planted. Oh, what a counter. Series of reversals. Super kick, a double super kick. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Bianca is losing any remnants of control now. Bianca unable to find breathing room. Oh, and she turns it around. Yeah, but Belair needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. And here is Belair forced out of the ring. To the outside. This could get wild. 
Delivered into the barricade. Face first off the barricade. And Belair gets beat to the punch. And another counter. To quote a pair of awesome scholars, in life, there are winners and there are losers. We are looking at a winner right now. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Raw Women's Championship. One of the best competitors in the women's division. Let's not forget the title is on the line here tonight. How can I forget? I've been looking forward to this match for a long time. Matches are where this woman thrives, and competing for that title is about as big as it gets.
Michael, Corey, you guys ready to feel the glow? Anyone? All right, just me. Byron, just because Naomi dances, that is not an open invitation for you to do the same. Why? Because Naomi's actually good at it. I can do the electric slide. Naomi's one of the most respected superstars in all of the women's division. One of the most athletic superstars in the history of WWE. A former pro basketball cheerleader, professional dancer, Naomi can do it all from bell to bell. And one of the most fun and exciting entrances in all of WWE. How can you not bob your head, Corey, when Naomi comes out? How can you not get lost in the moment? Go ahead, Naomi, get it, girl! I'm an unbiased broadcaster, Saxton. Or just a grump. Introducing the challenger from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. And introducing the champion from Orlando, Florida, the Raw Women's Champion, Naomi. The Raw Women's Champion possibly taking one final look at her title. This is all about being on top of the women's division on Monday Night Raw, waving the red brand flag high and proud. That is what the Raw Women's Championship means to these women. Oh. Naomi had it turned around. She has to do to get out of this. Tap out. Fighting desperately, she rolls her way out of the submission and takes control. Placing them into the corner. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. Step up for the side rushing leg sweep. Aggressive work on that shoulder. Cross body. Knee drop right on target. Watch out! He pulls on. And Naomi has taken the upper hand. Yeah, Naomi's at full throttle. Oh, elbow to the face. Up and oh, he dropped. The challenger's looking shaken. From up high, dodges. Uh oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Stop to the belly. one way to leave the ring, I suppose. She's got to be careful here. The referee will count her out. Double under with the fly. Two! 
into the barricade. Face foot off the barricade. Climbs back inside. Three. Ooh, I think she knocked her out. Kick it again to the back of the head. And over bearing him out of offense against Naomi here. Naomi needs to be resourceful in this situation. Producing a trampoline. from Naomi. Naomi managing to find some of that needed breathing room. Could be the turnaround Naomi needed in this match. Counters. This could be an opportunity. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. This. Boom. Nice. The chance rain on shaky ground now. This is a very dangerous situation now. From behind. This is just flat-out punishment. And now she's gained command of this one. You can tell she is fully focused now. Sweep the leg. Grabbing the leg, single leg, Boston crowd. Tap, 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 it's over. Got it, new champion. change we will all remember for a very long time i thought the defending champion had this well in hand but the new champ had other plans it just goes to show you anything The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Raw Women's Championship. Here she comes. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now.
You can see here the confidence of a true champion. The irresistible force. Jax has ruled the women's division since day one. She's held singles and tag team titles here in WWE and still wants more. It is absolutely impossible to plan against an opponent the size of Nia Jax. Nia Jax looks to be in a bad mood, and I'm pretty sure she's going to take it out on her opponent. Introducing the challenger from San Diego, California, Nia Jax. And introducing the champion from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia, the Raw Women's Champion, stunning Sandra Brown. As you can see tonight, this is all about hashtag women's title. Get your popcorn ready and settle in, folks. We are about to witness a clash through the ages. We know for a fact the Raw Women's Championship simply brings that drive, that passion out of superstars. So this match should be no different. And she saw that coming from Jax. Super kick, a double super kick. Jackson, a leg drop, thunderous 
nice leg drop. me happy. I kind of want to hop in there and celebrate with them. This woman is the real deal. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning Sandra Brown. Just because this competitor's career began in Hollywood doesn't mean you can't discount her fight. She's done more than hold her own since her days training at the WWE Performance Center. She knows she's swimming with sharks, and there's a sea of people who continue to want her to fail. She has stolen the show on many occasions, and I think she's planning on doing it again here tonight. Saxon, when's the last time you took flowers to the gravesite of those detestable, inflatable friends? I beg your and pardon. From San Jose, California, Bailey! 
Hey, despite what you think about Bailey, there's no denying what she's accomplished. The first Grand Slam champion in the women's division. And there's also no denying that Bailey has no problem stepping on anyone along the way. Because Bailey thanks herself for all of her accomplishments. And you can't argue with the results. Bailey knows how to win. Grown tired of being an underdog. She's tired of being overlooked. Has toppled every foe that stood in her way. This is a match where these WWE superstars take it to the match. To the extreme, there are no rules. As an agent of chaos myself, I've always had a little bit of a soft spot in my heart for extreme rules. Well, there's no question that extreme rules is in a category all by itself. Well, some people look forward to Halloween. Some look forward to New Year's Eve. Me, personally, I look forward to every extreme rules match on our shows. The fatigue is setting in for her. Oh, heavy duty right hand. Oh, what a boot to the face! Bailey showing no answer for the attack. Bailey looks to be well measured right now. Oh, a jumpy DDT. Absolutely planted. Bailey combats out of that. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Close line! Well, that'll leave a mark. She's taking things to ringside. She's produced a sledgehammer. She is aiming to cause serious Bailey harm. Way to steer clear. She turns it right around with a counter. Waist lock. No, no. Belly to belly. My goodness. This match is wearing her down. Showing a lot of fortitude in this Extreme Rules match for sure. But not sure how much more tenable it can be. She sent to the outside. Giving the people a chance to take in her undeniable greatness. From the apron. Good Lord. Taking flight. Talk about undeterred courage. Letting everything loose from the top turnbuckle. She's in the ring now. Back in the ring now. Oh, man. Absolutely planted. The springboard attack fails to land. Stomping down. And Bailey's having trouble managing his onslaught. Bailey's being cut off at every pass. She's pulling out a table, adding some furniture into the mix here. And Bailey gets cut right off. She'll take things into the ring. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. These strong attacks are keeping her up her game. And every attempt of her own offense is being subdued. She's bringing the table into play here. She is done playing around. Oh, 
shoulder. Looks like setting up for a suplex. Going to finish things off. She's taking this outside. This one cannot be lost by Kana. WWE Universe wants tables. Well, they've got tables. She goes back inside the ropes. And this match will head back to the ring. Martial arts techniques to the test. I would take that. And this one might be headed ringside. Going for it. Looking for the LaBelle one. A critical moment here. Are they going to tap? Are they going to break the LaBelle lock? And they did. Kick right to the leg. And Bailey never saw that coming. Doesn't look good. Yeah, she is in a rough spot now. Oh man, meeting the barricade. <laughs> Setting up. Full oh, vicious Russian leg sweep. Right into the barricade. What a shot! She's into the ring again. Take impressive power. Can she do it? Yes. Inverted suplex. <laughs> Bailey avoids it. You can almost see the gears turning in their head as they set up the table. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. And of all the toys under the ring, she settled on the baseball bat. Let me remind everyone, this isn't baseball. Backbreaker and backbreaker. More attacks like that will leave you gasping for air. Yeah, it looks like it already is. Oh, 
just turned that around. She left herself open. With no count outs, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. Climbs back into the ring. And that could be it. That might be the last punishment she can absorb. Her body can only take so much before we see a full collapse. And after all the damage the body has taken, I would be shocked if this match continues. A decision to continue could be career threatening. It's always great to visit the pay window, but a victory like this makes the winner's purse all that much sweeter. It's SmackDown's latest acquisition. The blue brand is lucky to have her. I tend to think everyone's replaceable, especially you, Saxton, but this superstar brings something different to the table. She's truly one of a kind. I tried to tell Lacey Evans what a fan I am of the woman's right, but she just called me a nasty, laughed, and walked away. Any chance I could persuade you to stick up for me? I guess I am a... The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning Sandra Brown. She says the thrill she gets from competing in the ring just hits different than being in movies. And her future is in WWE. If she's not on her A game tonight, it will hit different. And I guarantee she won't like it. 
One of the most anticipated matches we've had in quite some time. And this woman is the reason why. Sit up straight, Saxton. It's time to class up the joint. The sassy Southern Belle has arrived. And from Paris Island, South Carolina, Lacey Evans. Saxton, you ought to get a woman like Lacey Evans to keep you in line. I'm good just the way I am. But I, I'll tell you what, her questionable personality traits aside, Lacey Evans has had some pretty incredible victories against top talent like Dakota Kai and Candice LeRae. Questionable? Oh, questionable? Yeah, Are you questionable. kidding me? Lacey Evans is everything a woman should be. She's smart. She's strong. She's beautiful. She's smarter than you, Byron. A true lady with grace and confidence. How can you not love Lacey? And you have to respect the work this superstar has been putting in in order to meet the kind of challenge she faces tonight. Without a doubt, we've seen the hard work paying off. You don't find yourself in a match like this without dedicating your time into your craft. All that time spent has her in a good position to pull off the victory here. And with Lacey Evans, you have a superstar who seems more concerned with appearances than she does in-ring antics. But do not let that fool you. Lacey Evans is about as dangerous as they come with a mean streak to boot. Yeah, Lacey Evans is the picture of discipline in pinup model form. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. And right there, Evans finds out she's not the only dangerous and disciplined competitor in this match. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Stomping. Ouch. Overhand connects. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Big right hand. Lacey reverses it. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Suplex! Good timing with that reversal. Pow, what a shot. Oh, targeting the stomach. She's fighting back. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. And long. This could be it. One, two, three. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner, stunning Sandra Brown. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. We did a listener poll recently on my podcast, and turns out they'd be pretty pumped to see an Iron Woman match on SmackDown. Want to give the people what they want?
The following contest is an Iron Woman match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. Her presence certainly ruffled feathers in the women's locker room. No one wanted an actor slash reality star to take a spot on the roster. Other superstars thought she'd stroll in here once a week, wave to the WWE Universe, and leave. To this actor-turned-superstar's credit, she proved to be the real deal inside the ring. She knows tonight is going to be a big challenge, but if anyone is up for it, it's this woman. This woman reminds me of a rabid chihuahua. Nikki Cross. From Glasgow, Scotland, Nikki Cross. One of the things, uh, Corey, that Nikki's trying to do is concentrate on improving herself. Well, I guess anything's an upgrade when you spent the last several years in a straitjacket. Let's remind everyone of what these superstars are facing. Iron Man match means the victor has to earn the most falls within the time limit. That can take place via pinfall, submission, or disqualification in a count out. Jumpy <laughs> DDT! Absolutely planned. She's forced onto the defensive end. Wow, Nikki Cross manages to counter. There they go. Moves outside. What's the plan here? And finds a counter. Reversal. Can she capitalize? Enters under the ropes. Really just laying it in. That's one way to create some separation. She flips it back on her. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights out. This is not good. You don't say, Sax. Grabbing the leg, single leg, Boston crowd. There it is, there's the tap out. Probably tapping to preserve herself for the remainder of the match. Ooh, pinpointing the trachea. Oh, look at this. Oh! Whiplash, shoulders down! And she thwarts the pen attempt in one. Wow, I thought this was over. Oh! Flipped upside down there. What do we got to see here? Uh-oh. Submission maneuver locked in. Cross chicken wing. And there's the tap. Come on out, rep. Make her let it go. Ah. Oh, DDT. Absolutely 
Landon. Down by the DDT. Man, here it comes. That's kick. Cross is out. That's it.
absolutely planet. Slowly getting up, but 
she won't like what she's met with. Uh-oh. Here it comes. That's kick. Well, that proved to be enough this time. Trigger for Nikki to battle her way back into this. Got an elbow drop for added measure. physical matches we've ever seen. An Iron Man match takes a huge toll, but you're seeing the result of pushing through that to win. With a win like that, you have to stand back for a moment and realize all your hard work paid off. Ugh. I knew it was impossible to avoid you much longer. I was wondering why it smelled like expired moose jerky in here. A new perfume, or just your breath? Let's dispense with the pleasantries, okay? Thankfully, so far we've been able to stay out of each other's way, for the most part. But as we both climb the ranks of SmackDown, that's not going to be an option anymore. And there's only room for one of us at the top. Agreed. And I have to admit, it's pretty cool that we're going to be able to continue our rivalry from the PC here on SmackDown. I came to compete against the best. And more and more, that's looking like it might be you. <laughs> Might be? Is. And if you need proof, I'm happy to get in the ring with you anytime. Why wait? Let's go. I look forward to seeing what skills you've picked up since the PC. And showing you a few new ones of my own.
Well, looks like I picked the right week to visit SmackDown. I hear you and Josie are getting in the ring. Yep, should be fun. Let me offer you some advice and you can do what you like with it. I know a lot about deep-rooted feuds and squaring off versus someone from Calgary. There are a lot of ways to win, but the choices you make will determine the kind of superstar fans see you as. Makes sense. So the question is, do you take Josie out in the ring? Or do you get her before she even makes it there? Just like always, I'm a step ahead, and Josie won't know what hit her. Until she looks up and sees you. Bold choice. But I get where you're coming from. Jane is attacked from behind. Apparently her opponent didn't want to wait for the bell to ring. These two are evenly matched, but maybe not after this. What an explosive start to this match between Josie Jane and her incensed opponent. These two superstars haven't crossed paths yet in a major way since arriving on SmackDown, but that all changes here tonight. Soak it in, WWE Universe. We could be witnessing the very first blows of the next great rivalry in WWE. Oh, a jumpy DDT. Right. Now ah, trampling the opposition. From the outside, are you kidding me? Wait, wait a no minute. No way. Wait a minute. No way. Don't do it! Slaughter suplex! Good defense. Paying it back with their own counter. Suplex! Oof! Kick finds it. Suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come.
hope you're not spending too much time celebrating or reading your mentions on social media. I'm spending the exact right amount of time celebrating the absolutely glorious way I shut you down. You might have beaten me once, but I just talked to Adam Pierce, and now we're doing a best of three series. Nice of him to let me know. I'm letting you know now. And I'll let you know that I'm going to beat you twice to prove who's ready to take their career to the next level. Unless you can't handle that kind of pressure. I'm happy to give you another chance. Because I know I can handle the pressure. And I know I can beat you again. It's only going to help my case as I work towards being SmackDown Women's Champion. We'll see. Gentlemen, I think she's about to start a fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning Sandra Brown. She's been described as an underdog and even delusional, but she's never taken no for an answer. To her critics' disappointment, she thrived under the grueling training at the Performance Center and continues to prove herself today as a WWE superstar. One of the top names in the entire women's division, and she plans on showing exactly why here tonight. It's the up-and-coming Josie Jane. From Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Josie J. Matches like these with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is an art form. Josie J looks like she's about to bring the pain. Josie Jane and her opponent put together a thrilling classic in their first match on SmackDown. And fans everywhere will be watching on the edge of their seats tonight to see if they can do it again here in what has now become a best out of three series. The legends from all around the WWE Universe have weighed in to voice their enthusiasm over this electrifying new rivalry. And I'm right there with them. Did you hear that, John Cena? Saxton's with you. What a relief. As the leg trap, Fisherman Suplex. Over and over again, getting beaten down with force. She's helpless here. There it is. Each attack is just flaunting the incredible power this competitor possesses. Uh-oh. Half and half Suplex lights up. When is enough enough? We get the point already. Suplex, wrist clutch suplex, perfect. And you are seeing someone who is doing anything they want at will. Oh, that backfired on her. She was getting grinded down, but that could have just started a quick turnaround. Arm ringer, oof, and a finger snap. Oh, 
punishing the right arm. Ooh, well measured. Oh, target acquired and destroyed. Big mistake there, Corey. Oh, she knows that now. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Lands. Josie Jane reverses. Looks like Josie's got the upper hand now, trying to do everything she can to make up for losing their first encounter. Wait a second, Josie's locked in an arm bar. Will this be it? Will Josie Jane tap? Hold on, her shoulders are on the mat. Josie taps. The referee just counted the pinfall. But Josie might have tapped first. Maybe, but it's Josie who gets the win. I don't think the referee ever saw the tap up. I don't know who's more confused about this outcome, but clearly only one superstar is happy with it. This happens sometimes, Cole. The referee called what he saw. Was it correct? Not really. A hard-fought battle between these two, but you can't fault anyone who's not Josie Jane for coming out of this feeling a bit frustrated and disappointed. Extending this rivalry was absolute genius. Whose idea was that again? That's right, mine. Technically, it was Booker T and John Cena's idea, but sure, way to go. You know, it wouldn't hurt to compliment your boss every now and then. Might earn you some bonus points. She doesn't need bonus points. She won. It was a close finish, but I've got to respect the referee's call. I'm gonna have to dig deep to take the third match. You both will. And with that in mind, your final deciding match of the best of three series will be an Iron Woman match. We've competed against each other so many times in the past that this seems fitting. I could have thought of something better. Right, bonus points. Um, good idea, boss! Keep working on that. Oh yeah, I like her a lot. The following contest is an Iron Woman match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. This actor turned athlete shut out the noise from the haters online and immersed herself in the performance center system. Her background in physical action roles helped her make a smoother transition to in-ring competition. She certainly knows how to get a reaction and she'll get an even bigger one when she wins this match. Representing our neighbors to the north, it's Josie Jane. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Josie J. The WWE Universe delivering quite a reaction. Perhaps the most highly anticipated match of the night. 
Josie Jane looks ready to prove she belongs here in WWE. All-time series deserve all-time finishes, and that's exactly what we're on the brink of here as Josie Jane and her opponent get underway in the third and final match in this instant classic series. Speaking of finishes, both of these superstars will be looking to clear up any confusion left over from the dramatic conclusion of their last match. It's Josie Jane versus her noble nemesis in an Iron Woman match for the last word on one of the most exciting rivalries SmackDown has seen in years. Here it comes. Oh, this kick. Warm up the buses. This 
This one's over. Shoulders down. Plenty of hits coming your way now. Counters that. Uh-oh. Suplex. Lights up. Chubby oh, DDT. Absolutely planted. Oh, I don't 
think there is any way out of this submission. She's about to get this fall. Very unique escape to fight her way out of the sharpshooter. Down with a power bomb. And Josie still able to be the aggressor there. There's obvious wear and tear on Josie, but she's doing all she can to block it out. Ooh, she just turned it around.
able to get the advantage here. What a suplex. And Josie finds herself on the receiving end again. Time runs Here out is your winner, Sonny Iron Man Sandra Brown. Truly a hard fought victory at the end of the grueling Iron Man match. They are going to feel the effects of this match tomorrow. Josie Jane is a battle-tested veteran, so I don't expect this unfortunate loss to slow her down one... Listen, I don't know when we might meet in the ring again, but it's clear that neither you or I are going anywhere. I know I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. It's also clear that this rivalry isn't going away either. You're going to get some wins, I'm going to get some wins. I don't see any of that changing. But the one thing that has changed is that after that series, I certainly have gained a lot of respect for you and your abilities. Thank you. I appreciate you saying that. We might have had our differences, but I want you to know I've got your back. No matter what. And I hope when push comes to shove, if I ever need it, you'll have mine too. I will. Good luck out there. And maybe we'll both make that leap to the next level. Together. Yeah. Maybe. You know what one of my favorite sounds in the world is? Hearing the crack of a kendo stick over someone's back. I heard it at the first event I went to, and it's stuck with me ever since. I would love to see how vicious you could be with a kendo stick in your hand. Here we go, she is ready. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra from the moment this superstar left Hollywood and stepped in the ring, people said she had no business in sports entertainment. 
that her being in WWE was like tap dancing on thin ice. And it's only a matter of time before she'd fall through. The superstar has always been determined to let her success in the ring silence the haters. Byron, you better run. Because I heard the Empress of Tomorrow doesn't like you. Oh, no. And from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! Asuka has won multiple women's championships. She won the first ever Women's Royal Rumble. Even a former Money in the Bank winner. Domination and intimidation personified. You know, I asked Asuka about her plans for tonight. You know what she yelled at me? Easy peasy. Well, it's nicer than what she usually yells at you, Saxton. What are you trying to say? This is the type of match where anything can happen right away. Corey, what can we expect? Well, you're going to see a lot of chaos. It's all about who can control the chaos the best. There are no limits, and every resource is at a superstar's disposal. Oh, ooh, I think she knocked her out. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Fighting desperately, she rolls her way out of the submission and takes control. Elbow smash! Oh, that didn't go as Asuka designed. Asuka got out of the way. Series of kicks. That'll stun you. Watch her set up in the corner. Solely focused on in a corner. She returns the favor there. Ching, step up in Zaguri. She's enduring some damage. Striking with the axe kick. Victory yet. No count out as she takes this fight to the floor. And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Oh. Oh. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. Possession. Rare to see Asuka in distress like this. Kendo stick to the score. Ah. 
She's starting to drag a little bit. Yeah, the physical price of the Extreme Rules stipulation is really starting to show now. Taking this outside. This could be good. Oh, boy. Kendo stick in hand. Nefarious look in her eyes. on here. She's looking unstoppable actually. Ooh! Any one of these attacks could cause irreparable damage, but I don't think you can cut back from this many. We could be close to the end of the line for Asuka. Uh-oh. Here it comes. Next kick. Boom. And that baffled Asuka. Try to end it. One, two, three. And that's all she wrote. So perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation.